Hi, this is Kelly, a gringo living in Tulum, and today we're in a magical place called Isamal. It's about one hour from Merida and about an hour and a half, an hour and 45 minutes from Playa del Carmen in Tulum. It's a beautiful place, it's a magical place. You'll notice everything is painted yellow and white. I'm gonna tell you why in next episode. Come see, check it out with me. This safe and impeccably clean little village welcomes you and invites you to Walker Streets and explore her unique history. So we're back here in Isamal, this Pueblo Magico, which means the magic village. This is something that's very interesting about this place. You'll notice that everything is painted this beautiful ochre color. It's a yellow and white. So you might ask why. Well, it's a very traditional Mexican town. And when the Pope came to visit this little village, the city decided that they would paint everything yellow and white, which of course are the colors of the Vatican. So it's a very special, very unique place. And we're gonna go visit the main square and you're gonna see more really, really impressive things about this tiny little village. Come, let's see it together. So here we are in a great little store. This place is filled with all kinds of handicrafts, artisanal work. These are. These are really interesting little places. I can't tell you how much you're gonna enjoy it. You're just walking along this sun-drenched street and you go into a nice cool place and you find beautiful macrame dream catchers, mirrors made with macrame and with different kinds of rug, things made with twine, things made with vines. It's a lot of texture here, a lot of color and a lot of texture. It's a beautiful place, but check it out. Here we are again in Isamal. I don't think I've ever seen a more traditional, classic example of colonial architecture in Mexico. Everything here is traditional colonial Mexican. Check out these arches, they're beautiful. They're on all three sides of this magnificent, magnificent plaza, which has a frontage, of course, to the magnificent convent of the mothers, El Convento de las Madres. It's a beautiful, beautiful little square. You guys have to come and experience this. It's hot as heck, but you have to come experience it. It's beautiful. This magnificent courtyard was started as this project began in 1549. It's undergone lots of changes and it's built on top of Pyramids. This is the significance of this place is that when the Spaniards came here, they wanted to basically, well, let's say that they wanted to conquer the people, they wanted to take over the culture, and obviously they installed Catholicism as part of this process. So they built right on top of the pyramids here. This has been rebuilt three different times, but it got bigger and more expansive each time. And you can see what the result is. This magnificent courtyard with these beautiful colonnades, incredible arches and columns, and again, and that beautiful golden yellow ochre color and white. Here we are in front of the convento. We're getting ready to take a little ride with our beautiful horse-drawn carriage here. It's gonna be a historical tour. We're gonna to learn about the place and we're gonna enjoy the sights. And it's still hot out here, but you guys gotta experience this comfort. Let's do this together. Our Cuban-born carriage driver demonstrated his great knowledge and passion for his new home in Isamal. He's been here for more than 20 years and speaks of it with conviction and adoration. Every couple of blocks, he's revealed a detailed story about Isamal's history. If you're enjoying this lifestyle video of Isamal as much as I'm enjoying sharing it with you, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Instagram where you'll find out more about this and other interesting places around the Yucatan. Muchísimas gracias and adios.